So we're just gonna swoop right into our first segment with St. John's County Audubon member and steward, Blair Clark. We found Blair in the forests of St. Augustine, peering through the trees for some exciting birds migrating their way through Northeast Florida. He is an expert birder and he got us pretty fired up about all those birds in our trees. Hi, my name's Blair and I've been a member of the St. John's County Audubon Society for about five years. The cool thing about birds is that <laughs> you never really know like where they're gonna show up when. Birds you should be looking for are migrating warblers or swallows. I've been seeing painted bunting showing up at feeders and um, just the normal birds like um, blue jays and cardinals, those, everything is just really exciting and cool. So some tips for new birders are to get a field guide, um, find a good spot you like to go to see birds, um, learn your local birds, and get some binoculars, and also go out with birders that are better than you. You should plant native plants. There's things like beautyberry, which are great for birds. That's a um, one that puts out fruit. And um, the birds that eat fruit, like gray cat birds or robins, really like those. Or um, just native trees. Trees are just great to put out bushes. Bird feeders can spread diseases and sickness really easily when they're not clean. So always just make sure that you're cleaning them regularly when it seems kind of dirty or same for bird bath. You can totally have a feeder, you should just keep it clean. So the neat thing about birding is that wherever you go, there's always something like cool to look for. So whenever I go traveling, I always make sure to check what they're seeing around there and some birds that are like, that people just see a lot around there. Things are going to start back up in September. So some of my favorite meetings and events was like there's a trip down to Merritt Island near um, Cape Canaveral and that's great. There's a bunch of ducks and wintering birds and things like roseate spoonbills. The beginners that are just starting out and need some help finding good equipment, the Birding 101 is like perfect. It tells you cameras and binoculars and just also just like basic skills for birding. We're starting up a whole new thing of young birders, like walks and things like that, and I'm going to be leading some of them. So people, the young birders that are interested should definitely check it out. There's an awesome website that has info about like bird walks and um, events, and also the Facebook page is really helpful. To be a member of the Audubon Society, you just need to go onto the website and there's all the information on there. Cardinals, warblers, blue jays, oh my! Tell me about it, I can't stop looking into the trees ever since I met Blair. That was something else, and we are pleased to announce that we have...